You guys see? So the camera? Oh. <laughs> oh. Wait, hold on. Take two. What's up, everyone? Frick, here we go. <laughs> Welcome back to Merlino's Meals. This is the first edition, first recipe, where we cook great tasting food that's easy to follow along. Today, we're making one of my all-time favorite recipes. Watch me say that every single video we do. We're making one of my all-time favorites. It's a moist, gooey, delicious, chocolatey, vegan, gluten-free, can you guess it? Banana bread. Okay, before we start, I ask two things. Number one is please gently subscribe to the channel. Just go ahead and click that button. Number two is please like the video. It helps me out, helps the channel grow. Without further ado, get your aprons on and let's get cooking. Let's go. Wait, you forgot one important thing when you cook. What? It's in that cupboard down there, that drawer. You guys see? So the camera? Oh. <laughs> oh. Wait, hold on. I, 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 what does this one say? That one is this. La della Cucina. We're a family of Italians, so we'll go with the Italian apron. This is gluten-free, dairy-free, vegan banana bread. It's not fat-free and it's not low-carb though, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> Very simple list. Now we're gonna take you through the recipe. It should be fairly simple, pretty quick. And uh, let's get a bowl. Do you know where to look? Um, nope, where? nope, you're, you're cold. You're getting warm. Okay, we're gonna, we're you're getting so cold. Uh, it's in the you're, lazy you're hot. Lazy Susan. All right, so step one, we're gonna mix two tablespoons of the ground flaxseed with uh, five tablespoons of water. Good thing we don't have to get any measuring here because I know there's 17 grams in one tablespoon. So 17 times two. Ooh, so we need what? 34 grams of flaxseed. What did I say? 34. Five tablespoons of water. Five tablespoons of water. One and a half ounce, maybe. Wait. So you need... Listen to us. <laughs> I know. Five, so we need two tablespoons. Of... The camera's like adding pressure. I feel like I'm back on Survivor. Alec, dangerously close to immunity. And he's got it. Alec wins individual immunity. Safe tonight at Tribal Council. Two and a half ounces of water, two tablespoons of flaxseed meal. Mixing it together and then we're gonna let it sit for 10 minutes until it becomes a gel. Let's see the rice action. Okay, cool. So in the meantime, while this is gelling up, it's already kind of gelling. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. Overhead test. <laughs> Mash them in this bag. Okay. Right. Okay. Twist. Look at that. That kind of looks good. So your bananas are mashed. Okay, one third cup melted coconut oil is what we're gonna need. Mm -hmm. I'll just put this in the microwave. I don't right. think you can <laughs> put metal in the microwave. I know. Okay, <laughs> we're gonna put this in the bowl. All right, some coconut oil action. Well, you can't. I'm gonna melt it. I'm gonna melt it down. Last cup. Like, oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> we're gonna melt this. It's say like 15 seconds. A one half cup of maple syrup. I went for the Trader Joe's brand. Half cup, half cup maple syrup going in. Into the bowl along with the coconut oil. One fourth cup, I'm doing almond milk, barista milk. My coconut oil is going in. I'm just gonna go like this. Look at that. <laughs> you know why I did that? Why? I'm just gonna squeeze this bag going in. Ooh, that is kind of jelly, look at that. Cooking is all about how many bowls can you use? <laughs> how, many, how many things can you dirty? And the good thing is if you guys cook this at someone else's house, you don't have to do any dishes. Pancakes. Yeah, I wonder if you could make a pancake out of this. One teaspoon of baking soda, pinch of salt, and then cinnamon, pinch of salt. Let's say, teaspoon of baking soda. There's just a lot of pressure with everyone watching, so I just open the box like that. Oh. What does that look like? Baking soda. Yep. 
also looks like baking powder. Don't get them confused. Uh, the cinnamon, which the recipe doesn't call for a certain amount. Shake and bake. <laughs> Shake and bake. Mm. And then we also have pumpkin. I just think this would be good in the, in the banana bread, so. Yeah, why not? How thick you want it? You can do a loaf. You could do bread. Okay, it's my video. No, yes. <laughs> and now the last thing and the most most important thing, which really just packs the punch and elevates everything and ties it all together and makes it even more healthy, is what the chocolate chips. Semi sweet chocolate chunks. So we'll do about, I'd say that's like three fourths a cup. Okay, and then you don't have to do much stirring with these. Okay, 10 seconds. So I'm gonna teach you guys something. I've known this trick for years. And if you're a baker, you need to know it. All right, so just gently butter your whatever. Tin. Butter your buns. Butter your buns, tin glass, okay. And then I'm gonna take a little bit of this flour. Boom. This is like putting flour on the bottom of a um, pizza thing so it slides off and you can whoosh. We're gonna kind of like a little bit of this, okay? And then the excess, Perfect. we're just gonna toss down. 350 for 50 to 60 minutes, we're doing convection, so we're probably gonna do 350 for 50 minutes. Um, also, I'm gonna, I'm gonna link this recipe in the description for you guys. I'm gonna have all the calories for the entire loaf. We'll cut it up into like, depending on how many slices we get, we'll put calories. <laughs> All, right, All right, we're gonna pop this in the oven. 50 minutes at 350 on convection. Middle All right. rack. Middle rack, 50 minutes on the timer. We'll catch up when this is done. I don't, want the, I don't want the knife to stick to the banana bread, so I'm gonna do a little spray on it. There we go. Oh, look at that. Look at that loaf, dude. On conduction, needed to cook the whole time. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Merlino's meals. Um, I'm hoping to do one of those about once a week or every other week. So, recipe is in the description, it's linked. Comment what you guys want to see from me next time. I'm thinking maybe a breakfast burrito. We'll see. Be sure to subscribe to the Chan Chan and like this video. See you guys next time on Merlino's meals.